two weeks ago, we saw one of the senior athletes steal the show in the 50 freestyle. Wasn't seated first, seated in lane six or seven, came in and stole the event. Watch out for Chris Johnson. Victor Sokowski from Wheeler High School, his coach Rob Gass, his coach actually won an event here, the 100 freestyle back in 1984. There's very few of those coach coaches who have actually won an event swimming wise and come back and coach the state champion as well. Watch that young man. Watch out for uh, Sean Fitzgerald from Brebuff High School. That young man was entered in the 100 and 200 freestyle as a freshman. He's gonna have a strong second 25. And Kyle House from East Central High School, I don't think he's had his best swim yet either. That young man's gonna be a freshman at Purdue next year along with Sikowski. Watch those four gentlemen in this 50 freestyle. Who's gonna get that most explosive start? And when it comes down to those flags on in, Who's going to be able to put their head down, not breathe, increase that stroke tempo, and work the touch? Boy, the length on some of these athletes, just incredible. Lane six, Chris Johnson from Lake Central. Also looking at lane two, Kyle House from East Central, who you touched upon. Nathan Kenny is in lane one, then House, then Sean Fitzgerald of Brebuff, Sikorsky from Wheeler, Fosco's, Tyler Fosco's, the freshman from Chesterton, this Chris Johnson, then Kurt Green, and Brendan Joyce in lanes one through eight in this 50-yard freestyle. Going to have Sean McCarthy with us to take us to the uh, diving again. Thrilled to have him back with us. He was here a couple of weeks ago for the girls' diving and uh, just does a great job of making it as simple and as easy to understand as it can be for those of you who might be watching swimming and diving for the first time. Fosco needs to get a good start here. He needs to explode out. He needs to get out in front. Great breakout by the freshman. He's not afraid to swim against the older guys. House, Kyle House with an early lead over there in lane two. Hits the wall first as Kyle House from, from East Central. Foskis has got to move up. He's got to try to hold his place here for Chesterton. That's a great swim. Pretty Zikowski, even. 20.89. Wow. Wheeler the winner there. House from East Central finishes second. Brabuff finishes third. Receiving the eighth place medal today, Brendan Joyce for Carmel, swimming that 50 in 21.92 seconds. The seventh place medal was earned by Kurt Green for Mount Vernon with a time of 21.81 seconds. Sixth place medal goes to Nathan Kinney for Hamilton Southeastern, 21.61 seconds. The fifth place medal goes to Chris Johnson of Lake Central, 21.46 seconds. Fourth place is awarded to Tyler Foscos for Chesterton, 21.38 seconds. Third place medal is claimed by Sean Fitzgerald for Burbuff Jesuit, 21.35 seconds. Second place medal was earned by Kyle House for East Central with a time of 21.3 seconds. And ladies and gentlemen, your 2008 state champion in the 50-yard freestyle, Victor Sikorsky for Wheeler with a time of 20.89 seconds. Just incredible to note uh, some of the size disparity as we, um, we look at the podium from eighth all the way up to first. Uh, a tremendous difference in the size disparity of these athletes, but um, all great athletes in their own right. 